Hi my friends, today we model this part with the name Dumbbell Holder and this is the drawing. We start by creating this feature with dimensions 500 360 radius 50 of the center line curved center line and the angle of 30 new Standard millimeter side PT, new sketch, an XY plane. We make visible X axis and we draw lines from that axis up, vertical, sloped, down vertical we have to verify the placement <laughs> they are not on the line I apply coincident between this point and the line this point and the line on the same vertical is this with the center point equal is this with this angle of 30 degrees equal is this with this then we apply another dimension this one which is 360 And this is 500. Good. We have a fully constrained sketch. We apply fillet of 50 to this corner, this corner, and this corner. Then we hide that uh, X axis visibility, finish sketch. Then we select another plane, this one to create a new sketch F5 to see the previous view we project this line to have a point here then a circle of 25 and an offset of 1.5 offset of the circle 1.5 finish sketch we apply sweep for this area about this axis okay you see here dimensions and uh, also the thickness in fact all thickness are 1.5 for this, this and this. We continue with this uh, feature 80, 40, radius 15 placed at 70 from the XY plane which is this on a distance of 
1340 millimeters. We create a new plane based on XY on 70 for a new sketch. New sketch project this short line rectangle 80 tab 40 fillets of 15 on each corner coincident this midpoint with uh, this midpoint then offset of 1.5 1.5 finish sketch we hide this plane extrude this area on 1340 okay we select now this face for uh, creating or to create a contour I eliminate only this arc and now we can apply extrude the other direction 1.5 not cut but join okay this must be mirrored here to obtain the mirror plane we select both faces this and this you see now we can apply mirror of the last feature about this plane okay visibility now we mirror all this one two three uh, features about this plane we make visible that plane we apply mirror selecting one two three mirror uh, this okay we hide that plane and we have a new situation now we have to multiply this uh, feature at a distance of 150 will have nine features here on that distance to do this we use rectangular pattern we select features this is the only feature we select direction this is the direction the arrow is okay then nine at a distance of one one fifty okay next are these uh, two features the section is here fifty fifty radius eight and also thickness of one point five 
we select the same plane YZ we project this line and we draw a rectangle 50 tab 50 fillet of 8 on each corner then offset of 1.5 Finish sketch, we select extrude of this area on a distance of uh, 500 80 symmetrical. You see? Okay, you see here the distance, 580. We use uh, this uh, face to apply a lid. We project this geometry, and then we select one segment, we delete this uh, sign and the line. Now we can apply extrude of this area, the other direction, not cut, but join on 1.5 okay we mirror this last about the plane XY I may visible this plane mirror last feature mirror plane okay now we hide this plane and we activate the other one visibility because we have to mirror also one two three features about that plane okay visibility now we have the full result let's see what is the volume i properties physical update copy close drawing double click and the new value is identical with the other one so we cancel because the value is here good material is still carbon steel carbon and the view is uh, not default IBL but default lights if I place now perspective we can compare with the, the other you see 
they are absolutely the same. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.